guys, I'm Jess, and today on BFAP, I'm gonna do a Michaels haul. So I went to Michaels, they had a lot on sale, it was like super savings or something like that. And then they also had 20 off of $50. And apparently you can't use that on any great value items. Didn't know that, but I'm gonna show you what I got. And this is gonna be mostly like craft stuff. So if you guys like crafting, like I do, then you probably will like this video. So let's just start off. I got this plaque, wooden plaque. I use this for my unicorns, which you could probably see behind me, that one. All my plaque unicorns sold, so I need to pick up a plaque to put them on. So I picked this up. I think these are like $7 or something. So got that to make a unicorn. And I needed a lamp. Like I wanted one of these lamps that you can like adjust it. So I can put more light on where I'm working instead of like getting my face in it. So I bought this one and it's teal, which I love teal. And it was originally $30, it was 50% off. So it was $15 and then I got additional money off of it because of the 20 off of 50 thing. So I'm really excited. I think you just do that to like turn it on and off. I did buy a really, really cute one from, it was actually bigger than this. Um, from Target in the kids section like in the kids um, bedding and stuff they had like mint ones and I was like I'm about that life so I bought it and it was like a touch one and it was getting so hot and I couldn't like I couldn't touch it to make it like go off and it would just like stay on no matter how much I touched it which was really annoying and then I looked up the reviews and someone said it caught on fire <laughs> so I returned that one and then I bought this one so hey Wish me better luck with this guy. But I'm excited about that. And then I got some cork. This is just the cork roll. I don't know, that's what it looks like. So I can put on my coasters because I'm gonna start making coasters with alcohol inks and stuff. I did this one. I'll show you guys. I did this one. It's just a J and then it's on a mirror. And then I put the alcohol ink over it and then I'm gonna, um, resident so wish me luck with resin or epoxy or whatever I am gonna order and then I'm gonna put the cork on the bottom so it's not as like delicate almost and it will um, be better on like a tabletop or whatever so bought that this is cheaper because you can get like four round ones for like two dollars or something but this was three dollars you can get a lot more so I'll just cut them out myself that's not hard. Do you know if a Cricut can cut out cork? If you do, leave me a comment down below. I am interested in finding that out. So I got some original tacky glue. I guess this is supposed to be like really good. Premium all purpose adhesive. So I'm gonna try to use this to attach my unicorn instead of hot glue and see if it works better. So wish me luck on that. And I have some Cricut products. I have a Cricut, you guys know, you might have seen my um, felt video that I did about using the Cricut. I'll put it up here if you guys haven't seen it yet. But if you have a Cricut and you were trying to use felt, I did a lot of troubleshooting. I told you about it and told you what felt to get to use with your Cricut. So if you're having any issues, make sure and check out that video. But I did purchase some transfer tape. This you can use on um, just solid colors basically from Cricut. You can't use it on like the glitter or the hol well, I think you can use it on holographic. You can't use it on glitter. Glitter you have to use like the extreme grip or something but this is just a normal transfer tape. I was getting low and I make a lot of cups like, like this one like a makeup brush holder. I make a lot of these. So this one I um, used black vinyl I obviously transferred it with this and then I use alcohol inks for this cool like stained glass effect. This is for sale if you guys want it. It's $10 plus shipping. Just leave me a comment down below. But I made that and turned out really, really good. I made um, another one that has the actual like the rose in there. Here, I'll show you guys. This one. This was one of my testers because I was trying to figure out what to do to seal it. So I'm going to do a video about that too actually. But I made this one too and it turned out really cute. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. So if you like either one of those, you can order one for me. And the Cricut stuff was 40% off, which Cricut never really goes on sale. So I was like, I'm gonna stock up on some transfer tape because I was getting low. And I also got some premium 
black vinyl from Cricut as well. That's what I used to outline those cups and then I colored it in really cute with the alcohol inks. But yeah, this is also 40% off. Removable matte, yes. Yay, yay, yay. I don't know if I actually, I guess the other one I have is glossier. I don't know, I might have to look at that. I didn't realize I got matte. Does it come in glossy? I'm still new to the whole Cricut thing, as you can probably tell. I got two, is it Primo? This is just clay, oven big clay. I use this to make the horns for my unicorns and my deer's ornaments, and I'm trying to get ahead of the game because those unicorn ornaments sold like no one's business and I'm trying to get ahead of it and make all of the little things that go on it like the ears and these and like the eyelashes and stuff so I'm going to make some horns. If you guys want to see me making horns leave a comment down below and I'll like do a little video. But I got two of those and I did get I think this is 18 karat gold or something. Let me look. Yep 18 karat gold. It has like a shimmer. I don't know if you can see that, but it's really pretty. Oh, I forgot I got some glitter. So I got some just white glitter. I needed some for my cups that I make. This one's still drying, but I make makeup brush holders, glitter ones, and then I put like cool sayings on them and stuff. So I'm making that one. I also am experimenting. This one isn't dry yet either, but I put bigger glitter in it and it made this like really cool effect. The only problem I had was the bigger glitter chunks, like the unicorns, didn't adhere very well. So I'm hoping they dry clear because like glue got stuck in there. But the smaller ones did a great job. So this was just like a tester cup. Next I have some cards. When people buy from me, I always put a little thank you card in there. So I bought these, they're $5. These are only $20 or something insane. It's a hot buy, yes. There are over 60 cards in here. I thought they were really cute. So there's like a unicorn one and make magic one, which I thought was pretty. And you are mermazing. And there's a hello one. There's ones with mermaids on it. It looks holographic as well as a thank you one that has fairies on it, which you can see in the front. But I was like, that's a good deal for a lot of cards. And I go through thank you cards pretty fast. I just actually bought some cute ones. Um, that says thank you a latte and it has a little, um, coffee cup and then I also found these I'll just show you these are from Dollar Tree they're only a dollar they're so cute I love the pattern I've already um, gone through all these that I had before so I bought some more you only get six but it was only a dollar and they are um, Hallmark brand <laughs> and I also got two of these white crates these right here they sell them in white now I wish they would have sold them in white like I don't know a year ago when I bought these and then painted them white and it was such a pain in the butt and I couldn't spray paint them outside. I think it was too cold or something. So I literally had to paint it and it just like was horrible. Just spray paint them. That's so much smarter. <laughs> but I bought two of these to put behind our bed to kind of put like pillows on stuff on top of like the decorative ones. So they're like out of the way. But I bought two of those. And that is my whole Michael Salt. I hope you guys like this. If you did, make sure and give this video a big thumbs up if you like Michael's hauls. And also, um, you can find me here on social media and see all the things I'm making. I've been making a lot of different stuff lately. And check back every Tuesday and Friday for new videos and click that button below to subscribe. Bye guys, thanks for watching.